Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am back with two haul videos. Um, it's a Walmart and Dollar Tree combined. So, <clears throat> that said, boy, this accident is being a pain in the tush. Alright, so, I'm going to turn you back down. I have to move my water every time I do the video, so hold on. Say hi to Sassy. Hi, Sassy. Yeah. Okay, at Walmart, let's we'll start off with this one. I can't remember if I've already showed this to you or not, but my husband got me this. It's the Craft, the Legend, the new one. Can't wait to see it. Um, this I know I haven't showed you yet. Uh, he got me this Crayola tin. These are blending markers. Um, it comes with 14 colors and two blending pens. I'll show you the nibs. That is the nib on them. Cannot wait to use these. She's in the spot where I was going to put everything. Okay, what I went to Dollar Tree, f or shoot, Walmart for, was these. It's a 24-pack of the colored pencils, color of the world. It's the skin colors. It gives you the colors on the sides. These were $3.97. These are not clearanced at my store, but the 32 counts of crayons are, and they're a dollar. And the 24-pack of markers are also three dollars but they also had the six pack and the eight pack of regular color pencils on sale for like two and three dollars two dollars I think and then they had the silly scents for two and three dollars as well um, I didn't get any of those I have a couple and yeah Sassy, I can't do this video with you right there because you're being annoying. Okay, so this is my Dollar Tree haul. Um, I found the silver marker, like the one that Miss uh, Ray sent. I found the gold marker, and they only had one of each. Then I found uh, the piercing and scoring tool at uh, another one. I found a glass pen and ink set. Smooth writing, bright colors, easy to clean. Uh, this one is from Miss Ray. But I got me, I got myself one and I really like it. It's, it's really cool. Sorry. I was out of my red, almost out of my red glitter glue. So I got another, I got this pack of three. You know, you can see red, gold, silver. Love that stuff. I use it for everything. These are colors I hadn't seen before. This one is a copper. That's a deep blue and then the pink. So I got those. Um, I found these adorable LOL series girl stickers. So I got one for me and one for Miss Ray. I found these two pin sets. Again, the store I found them in only had one of each, so I got those. I found the felt bunny kits. I can't wait to put those together. I'm loving these little kits and stuff. Oh, here's the other set of pen I thought I got. I thought they had three. Um got some table scatter. I 
I have these unicorns because I thought I could make shakers out of them and I still am. As you see, I took the stuff out of the one. Oh, let me tell you, if you do mixed media, take the slime out. <laughs> I just, I let it sit, and now it looks like a bicycle seat to me. But anyway, apparently if you let it dry, it gets really hard. Look at that. I can't bend it anymore. So that's going to be really fun to put in stuff and use it for mixed media. So, I wanted to show you guys that. And all I did was take it out and lay it down and it, it dried out in a couple of days. I also got the hearts that I can make shakers out of those. Okay, last three things in my bag of Go that bag away now is my Dollar Tree had graphite pencils, six of them. They also had six metallic pencils. And then they had six watercolor pencils. So I got those as well. Yes. And that is... My Dollar Tree haul <laughs> and my um, Walmart haul, but it's not all. I just didn't want you to watch me clean off my desk, so you just have to look at my mug for a few minutes as I drop everything on the floor. So give me a second. Hold on. Okay, so the other thing I wanted to show you in this video this back over here. This one's gonna be a little bit longer than the other two videos. I apologize. No, I don't, not really. I'm not sorry. <laughs> Is I wanted to show you guys what I was working on for my colored pencils. I know I gave you guys a little glimpse of it the other day. See right there. But I got it finished, other than the pencils that you just saw me get, that I still have to put in here. But, I left places for them. Oops. Except for the ones that Ray Ray got me, because I didn't know about those. Alright, so I'm going to turn you back over here. There we go. Alright, so these are what I came up with. These aren't attached to the base yet, so I can show you. So I sewed my elastic and on both sides. And then I turned them inside out and sewed them together so that they would slide over a protector. Okay, now these just slide off because they're not attached. I haven't finished them. These won't slide off because I've got double sided uh, carpet tape on them. So right here are all my graphite pencils. And then I still have this side to fill. Uh, more of my graphite because I put that on here backwards. I have to turn it around. Um, that's graphite and charcoal. More graphite and drawing pencils. My no name colored pencils. Uh, these are art skill, well, no name, art skill. This is where my jot's going to go that I just got. These are color time, or timeless color, color creation. It was a kit my, my husband got me. Uh, these are more art skills. 
uh, these are my Stamping Up and these are Fiber Pastel these are EK Memory these are my Creative Charms more Creative Charms then it goes into my um, Crayola Skins colors into my 100 pack of Crayola crayons and I left spots for my colored pencils that I got like I said and it closes up like that I am going to have to make a uh, band to go around it because it is so big and it, you know, it's not going to stay closed, but I don't care. The next one I'm doing, that's why I've got these, and I've got one to sew, is I'm doing all my gel pens the same way. Hi. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to be doing my gel pens uh, the same way as in these books. Um, I just think it's cool. Um, my alcohol inks and my permanent markers are all, let me turn you, I'm trying not to make you sick. Say hi to the camera, hi camera. They're all right there. Now let me see what I take up. Turn up the light. There are the first set of alcohol, then some permanent markers, next set of alcohol, and blendable markers, then my Bix, then more Bix and glittery, and then those are the paint pens. I'll turn you around slowly. Oops. Hi. That's me again, Margaret. <coughs> Who knows what song that's from? Anyway, so that idea I got from another person uh, they had the mini CD rack on their table well I couldn't find a mini one uh, Goodwill had that really tall one um, I've got to make a stand to sit next to my desk to put it on because that's way too high for right now it's right there because I was going through all this stuff <coughs> but yeah that's gonna go on a stand next to my desk so it's easy access and everything's at my fingertips when I'm coloring and uh, yeah I think that's about it that's what I've been working on that's what I've been doing uh, in between coloring a few things here and there so I hope you guys enjoyed this little sneak peek at how I'm doing my colored pencils and how I'm getting ready to do my gel pens. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the description box below. Um, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, hit the little bell. You'll get notified every time I upload a video. I'm going to try to do better of uploading. Um, would you guys be interested to watch me sit in color? I'm not like one of these professional colors. I just color to suit my taste. Um, Let me know in the comments below. Uh, let's see. Oh, I do have a chocolate factory that I am working on. Once I get all this sewing out of the way, I will finish that up. And 
I'll do that on camera. That way it'll be a few videos. Um, I'm trying to think. I think that's about it. So until next time, I want to say bye from Tennessee. Bye!